Hello friends, welcome to Frenchie's video. I'm Franz Martin, independent demonstrator with Stamping Up, and today I'm in my kitchen. What am I doing in my kitchen? Well, I still have some uh, wood uh, stamp that I'm going to share. If you do have wood stamps, some of you get some way old, old uh, stamps also that before we had the cling or the clear. I'm going to share with you how you can remove that and have a cling. I will not remove this because I'm doing another video that I'm going to share down the road here. Um, I needed this one that needed to be on the Stamparatus and I was like I could have used the Stampamagic but the Stamparatus it's much easier. So I'm going to take this I'm going to put that in the microwave and I'm going five seconds and you can uh, start maybe with three seconds. Maybe you're going to have to go at uh, 10 seconds. Depends on your microwave. And then see, it's going to peel right up. So it is simple. Now you're going to take this also while it's warm and peel the design, the, the stick on here. Okay, now I don't want to use this on the Stamparatus. Sometimes it stays sticky right now. This one, it's not sticky, so my microwave did a very lovely job. If you ask me what kind of microwave I got, it is um, a GE, and I think it's like a 1200 watts, whatever, it's a big watts one. So this year, what I'm using here, this is from the new cling stamp that we got. And when I put a stamp set together, I save the back. So I use it all. So one thing you want to pay attention, though, let me move this here. It's like the stamp set would go down here. And then the back of this, that would be what um, go. So the stamp set, you would take it go this way. So that's what you have to remember. Sometimes when you peel this up, you lose track where the sticky is. So I want to make sure I going it. This is the artist job here to peel this up to have the sticky down. So remember, it was facing this way. Now the camera shy here. Okay, I still have my piece there. I'm going to take this like this. This is a very good piece there. And that would be the way that this was, right? So you want to make sure you keep that same side. Now I'm going to take this and put that right here. I still have a very good piece here that I can use. So what I'm going to do is take this back. Well, let's cut this off here. Oh, don't go there. Woo. So I can save this piece here for another uh, set. I want to make sure I'm using the correct side. Okay, that is shiny. I'll make sure. Okay, this way. So I'm just going to put that here because I can put another one. So now you get this. Just take this and lift the back of this. Et voila! Now, I got my cling stamp, see? Voila! And then remove it. That's simple, my friend. Oh, I forgot one step, honey. Usually, well, let's fix that. Usually, I would take my image, because I want my image here. Here we go going to put my image there. You would put the image before you put this on. Now let me put this here there. Here we go. I'm just going to toss this away. So learn from my mistake again. That's why you watch my video, right? To watch my mistakes so then you won't make them. So you want to put the sticker on before you put the this you don't have to cover the entire thing you just a little bits and piece that is perfectly fine you don't i mean you can do maybe a little strip but see now it's there voila stay very good so that's how i done my switch from the wood now the wood is very sticky see the stick stay there so you can 
toss the wood out or you can use it for another craft product so that is it my friend for my tip of the day hope this is going to help to um switching your wood stamp to the cling or if you get clear stamp set you know the old one that used to be called clear but they're the red rubber but not a good sticky in the back you can take little strip of this and just put in the back of the clear one and they're going to cling very lovely this is it for my tip of the day have a lovely day my friend bye bye for now